All right, I'm Xavier Silas. I'm 6'5", 200 pounds from Northern Illinois University. Xavier, what do you feel like you're going to bring to the NBA? I think I'm going to bring some defense. Definitely going to bring a lot of defense. I know that's how I'm going to get on the court. Big guard, I can guard the one, the two, and the three probably. And I'm also going to bring uh, a little bit of shooting. I can shoot. I'm, I'm known as a scorer. You come from a, a lineage of NBA. Your dad played in the league. You've been around NBA players for most of your life. How does that kind of help you as a player, develop as a player? Well, when you have an ABA All-Star that lives with you, it's, kind of, it's good to, to just go down the hall and ask them a couple of questions, get a lot of, got, get a lot of uh, information from them. So uh, it's good, and we talk every day about how I can be better, and it's, it's a good process, this drive process. You know, you were part of that New Jersey workout, starting to get some teams lining up. Now that you're starting to hear NBA teams talk about you as an NBA player or an NBA prospect, what is that like for you, and what do you feel like you now have to prove to those people? Well, you know, coming up, I've always thought that I was going to be an NBA, all or not an awesome, but an NBA player. And so when they talk about it, you know, it's just a, it's a good feeling because it's something that I've worked for. But now I feel like I have to work even harder to, to prove to them that I belong on the court and get playing time. and and belong in that circle. You know, you talk about working to improve your out here at Impact Basketball. What specifically are you working on? What do you feel like you've got to do before you go into these workouts to kind of cement yourself as a draft pick? I think that I just have to be consistent in what I do. You know, I'm a scorer, so I have to be consistent in different ways that I score. Uh, coming off the ball screen, handling the ball, I'm probably have to play a little one. So I've been working on that and I'm getting a lot better at that. So it's just overall just getting better in my game. You know, you're out here with a very crowded group, a lot of named players, mm -hmm. guys that are likely going to be first-round draft picks. Do you feel like you're one of those? Do you feel like you're a first-round draft pick? I do. I feel like I can go in the first round, and I compete with these guys every day, and they know that, and I know that. So it, the, everything will come out, and everything will surface at one point.